Welcome back. Before we get into today's vlog, I want to give a special shout out to our sponsor for today's video. Teenu is an online marketplace that offers extremely competitive prices for home decor, jewelry, and fashion pieces. Their products on average is 50% cheaper than identical products that you can find on similar shopping sites, which can be a steal. So they were so kind to send over a few pieces that they wanted me to share with my kindred. And I'll be the one to tell you, I don't think that you'll be disappointed. I'm gonna first get into this sportswear set. This is a crop top, long sleeve, and high-waisted legging set that you can literally find anywhere, but not for the price that Team U is offering. This is a staple set that I feel like every girl should have in her wardrobe, because you can wear it with anything. You can dress it down with tennis shoes, you can wear boots, you can wear heels, you can wear sandals. Y'all know how to style pieces, I don't even have to tell you. But the fact that it's listed on their website for $16, especially with this material and quality, I've seen sets like this on other sites ranging from $30 to $80. And Team U is offering this set for $16, not only in black, but in also 14 different colors. Pause. Team U is offering us an extra 70% off of this set. It's only $5.99 right now. Ugh. I like that I don't feel restricted when wearing it. It has a little bit of stretch. I really appreciate the thick band around the waist because they really accentuate your waist. So yeah, I'm definitely gonna cop me a couple of more of these sets in a few different colors, cause maybe, yeah. I need to add more to my essentials list in my wardrobe anyways, cause a lot of my pieces in my closet are loud and I need more staple pieces, stuff that you can wear over and over again in different ways, and this is definitely one of those sets. Now this blouse, this blouse that I came across, I said, oh my God, this is so cute. It is a crop top black blouse. You can wear it as a jacket or you can wear it as a shirt. I wore it as a jacket already, but the next time I wear it, I'm definitely gonna wear it as a shirt, you know, take my blues up, have the tie ties out. What really sold me on this top were the sleeves. The dimensions and how the sleeves were cut out. This is so cute. And the quality is so good. It's not giving cheap at all, but it's listed on their website for $12. $12. When I saw that, I was like, no, I, I cannot believe this, because this jacket is so cute. If you don't follow me on Instagram, I'm gonna need for you to follow your girl at Noah J. Noir because I already posted a picture in this top. I also have a wardrobe Instagram where I post a few of my pieces from my wardrobe that I've already taken pictures in on Instagram. I'm gonna start posting on there more often and um, do giveaways because I need to clean out my closet. So if you're not following me at NLSA the Wardrobe, then I'm gonna need you to follow me at NLSA Wardrobe so that way you don't miss out. Well, actually, y'all won't miss out because I'll announce my giveaways in my vlogs and then I'll also be posting it on my Instagram. Next, we have this asymmetrical bohemian style maxi dress. This dress is so pretty. It only comes in one color, which is brown. And I just love the way it feels on my skin. It just looks all good on my skin. I love the cutout of this dress. Everything about this dress is screaming material girl. <laughs> And it's just overall sexy. So it's listed on the website for $15. $15. This dress right here is $15. What they say? I can't wait to I can't wait to fit my little skinny ass up in this. Isn't that what they say? <laughs> no, this is so cute. Uh, I'm excited to wear this. Next we have this cobalt blue velvet cocktail dress. This is the color that I chose for my prom dress. And I just absolutely love cobalt blue. My mom put me onto this color. Cause I didn't know anything about like cobalt blue. And when she told me like, oh, cobalt blue looks so good on you, da da da. And I chose that as my prom dress. Ever since then, cobalt blue has been my favorite, one of my favorite colors. My favorite color is black, but next to black, 
cobalt blue. But this dress comes in three different colors. It comes in red, purple, and the cobalt blue. And it's listed on the site for $15. This is another $15 dress. This is a $15 cocktail dress that is just so cute and it fits so good. And I mean, it has stretch to it. It's not stretchy, but it has like stretch to it. I got it in a size small, so I would say if it's true to size. Now I'm about to get into their accessories. So I've been wearing this one specific bag with almost every outfit because it's like my new favorite. I probably wear this bag like three or four times a week. It's so cute, it's simple. It literally goes with any outfit. What I really love about this matte zipper shoulder bag is that it has an adjustable strap. So that way I can just wear it tucked underneath my arms. I love this bag and it's listed on the website for $14. This is a $14 bag. And to me, it kind of sort of resembles the Nano Fendi Graphy Fendi bag that costs almost $1,300. So, yeah, this was like a cute dupe in my brain. My brain processed it as like a cute Fendi dupe type of bag. Now we have this cocktail dinner bag. I call it the cocktail dinner bag because it just reminds me of a bag that you would just wear with like a cocktail dress or to a day party, um, things of that nature. It's listed on their website right now for eight. <laughs> eight dollars they also sent over two pair of frames that are both under five dollars but i'm not gonna lie my favorite accessory out of all of them are these really cute fluffy ear warmers <laughs> they are currently listed for three dollars and five cents they also come in four different other colors such as white, cream, brown, gray, and even pink. So yeah, that concludes the segment of this video. I'm gonna link everything down below in the description box. And I'm also gonna leave you guys with a discount code that you guys can enjoy when you are shopping with Team U. But do me a favor, take a second, pause this video, and leave a comment down below, leaving you guys' thoughts and opinions on today's haul. Now that you guys have done that, let's get right into today's vlog. Actually, we're catching up from last week. Yeah, 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 this is a part two from last week. Duh. Okay, so change of plans. I'm actually going to go to Lucian. Lucian is a book and wine store um, here in Buckhead. I've never been there before, but I came across it, I think on like an Instagram advertisement. So I was like, oh, that'd be nice. Um, I've had that written down in my planner for like the past two months, but I'm actually just gonna go ahead and go. I think this outfit better suit that vibe. Anyways, so yeah, I'm gonna go to the wine bookstore. I'm taking my laptop and I have a lot of things actually that I need to do that I'm excited to do and that I'm excited to talk about. I'm probably not in this vlog, most likely in like the next vlog because I want everything to like fall into place first before I talk about it. But yeah, so um, I'm about to call my Uber and go there. I haven't had dinner yet either. I'm really hungry, so I'm gonna eat there um possibly go ahead and break my fast for today and just have a glass of wine and um yeah do my work on my computer i'm also bringing my tripod too because i need to take a picture in this outfit so i'm gonna take my tripod and take a picture yeah let's go be productive i guess you wanna know where i've been i search you find the love within I came back to let you know Got a thing for you And I can't let go So the, I went, I, I attempted to go to the wine bookstore I walked in, you know, I had my camera ready This girl comes to me, she said, oh, I'm so sorry We're close for a private event yeah, I'm sorry, and she opened up the door for me. It's cold. I Ubered there, it's cold. It's already eight o'clock at night. Well, almost eight o'clock at night. I'm like, what am I supposed to do? So I ended up finding this cute restaurant called Tabla, which is right next door. And yeah, I'm just gonna do my work here. It's not a lot of people here. I got my headphones because I got all the noises. And I ordered me a cute little starter, appetizer. And I'm having a glass of wine because I deserve it. And yeah. And then before I leave, I'm gonna take some cute pictures. So I can play. Being 
initiative. It's Wednesday. <laughs> that time I was like, what? You was working. I think this is him right here. Working, I was working. Huh? <laughs> no, she was working too. <laughs> but a little bit of twerk. Yeah, a little content. Just a little bit. Any and everything that has just been weighing on me, taking up space in my mind, my spirit, my energy. It's just time to let go because I really just want to take all of my energy and focus on things that I only need to be focus on, focusing on, which is things that is only going to help me progress and grow in every aspect of my life. So it's time to get rid of some things. Um, it is the very next day, and I am actually going to start with washing my dishes that I um, let pile up since yesterday morning. And I'm going to shower, wash my face, wash my teeth, you know, do all of that good stuff. And then I'm going to go ahead and um, declutter my closet a little bit more and then we have to get rid of this box that i talked about in the last vlog a little bit you have to get rid of this box this box has been sitting here for the past couple months ever since i've got my caribou package i've saved the box and i have put things in the box thinking okay no, Jerry, i'm just going to I didn't even know what I was going to do with it. I didn't know if I was going to create a shipping label and ship this stuff off. I didn't know if I was going to donate it. I didn't know if I was just going to toss it out. I didn't know if I was going to burn it. Like, I didn't I didn't know or don't know exactly what I'm going to do with this stuff, but it got to go. Yeah, I'm going to cleanse out my closet as well because I also have a bag on top of the box that have, like, clothes in there that I don't wear that I was going to donate. So what I'm going to do is, yeah, go through my closet one more time, get rid of things that I don't need because I really just don't have the space for all of the stuff that I have. I don't have the space. And then uh, we're gonna figure out what we're gonna do with this box. And then I have my friend, Joe. She is coming into town. She is a flight attendant, so she's flying in today for work. And um, she wants me to cook dinner. She wants me to cook pasta. So I'll run to the grocery store and then I'll come back and then cook dinner. And uh, yeah, just vibe out. So that's gonna be my day. My friends wonder what is wrong with me. Well, I'm in a day from your love, you see. I came back to let you know. Gotta thank you, and I can't go. Some people go around the world for long. But they may never find what they can dream of. What you won't do, do for love. You tried everything, but you won't give up. You did my way, only you. Make me do what I'm worth. Basically, I have a monthly subscription with Zips by. Every month, they send me a box full of herbal teas, chai tea, coffee. You can do caffeinated, non-caffeinated. It's just completely up to you. So how it works is you go on the website and you take a quiz. And you can either customize your box yourself or just have them randomly send you things. I'm going to start today off with something new. Normally, I would do a coffee or a tea. But I chose to do chai tea today. And I just sweetened it with some honey and a little bit of creamer. And yeah, that's that. This is my first time actually making chai tea and even drinking chai tea. So I haven't, I haven't necessarily tasted it yet, but I did take a sip out of the spoon. And this is pretty good. I might be a chai tea girl, not a tea girl. We did not do anything that we planned on doing last night. I literally set up and I realized that I didn't have any tape. I just wasn't in the mood. I wasn't in the mood, so I laid my tail down and I just, was in my head all night until I fell asleep. So 
we're gonna try it again today. Actually, I need to go on Amazon and order me some tape. So hopefully, hopefully, that's something that can come in before, like same day shipping. Hold on, let me see. I don't know, this is an acquiring taste. It smells better than it tastes. Maybe I just gotta get used to it. This wig has been on for quite some time now and it's definitely time to take it off, refresh it, revive it. I'm trying to make it stretch because it started off as 30 inches and I've worn it so many times, now it's given 20. Um, I found these 613 um, tracks laying around. I was like, hmm, let's do something different. So I was looking for my Willa Charm um, Ash Toner, but I didn't have any. Um, so I came across these Ash Toners that I got from when I was in school from Aveda. I was like, let's just do that. but. I realized that I didn't even have any 10 or 20 volume developer. I was so upset. So I came across these purple and blue shampoos that I've had for the longest. And I was like, hmm, let's, let's, let's do this. I haven't done this in a while. Like use purple shampoo to tone hair. As you can tell, because watching this is very cringing. You should not be putting the purple shampoo directly onto the hair. Because, girl, as you can tell, it's, it's turning purple. Okay? <laughs> that was not the goal. So, yeah. I had to do a lot of shampooing with sulfate-based shampoo to strip the hair of that purple tint. And, um, yeah, it just took me a long time to get it right. But your girl got it somewhat right. I ended up um, stripping the color and giving it a bath instead in the purple shampoo to kind of ash it out. Um, I didn't get all of the purple tones out, but I got majority of it out. I only need a couple pieces anyway, so it is what it is. I mean... We made it work, okay? Let's just say we made it work. And this is an easy way for me to quickly dry hair, just placing it in a towel, covering it, and bam. So I went ahead and I took a lunch break. Shout out to Trader Joe's. I'm telling you, they make the sponsor, your girl. And look at Nala Fuvera, that is my girl. Ah, she's so cute. But yeah, now that the hair is dry, I'm just gonna go ahead and do a quick install while I run my mouth to Brandon. And look at the baby hairs. Well, it's not really giving baby, it's giving teenager, but that's okay. So yeah, as you can see, some of the pieces are still purple, but I was able to lift it a little bit. So I'm just gonna use the pieces that turned out a-okay, and I'm just gonna glue it. So this is my first time doing this look, so I just wanted to kind of like try it out, you know? But for my clients, I'm gonna be using tape-ins to replicate the style. I was running my mouth to Brandon and so we're talking and he starts flirting with this girl and then hangs up in my face. So I called him back a few times and he didn't answer the phone. Now he got a nerve to try to call me back. Uh-uh, I was not having it. Ah, uh -uh, motherfucker, stupid ass bitch. Fuck yo dirty ass, yo dirty funky skeet draws having ass ignorant ass doofy ass you is a fucking liar you're a fucking liar but anyways yeah I am loving this pickaboo color like even the curls I like that. Bounce more than a scribble's ass. Ah! Yeah, yeah. So yeah, I just ended up um, pin curling my hair, letting it cool off, letting it dry. And yeah, this is how it turned out. I absolutely love it. So um, I did post this look on my website if you guys are interested. Like I said, I'm not going to be gluing the tracks onto the frontal to replicate this look. I will be using 613 tape-ins and toning the tape-ins. And yeah, so if you haven't already, go ahead and check out my website, icbangs.com. I'm also running a sale, so you just have to use my discount code KENDRED10 to get 10% off of your purchase. And you can also use ShopPay. Shop is available on my site right now where you can shop now and pay later. So, yeah.
now it's time for dinner. I went ahead and I just made me a salad, topped it with some tuna, some cheese, and some granola, and that was my day. Say hello. You wanna say hello? When I go to the sauna, I like to take my own hot tools, even though they do have a flat iron there. I like to take my own hot tools, and I'm taking my curling iron and my baby flat iron, so that way I can like fix my baby hair. And then I'm um, obviously taking my got to be spray, my um, foam mousse, my hair, my hair oil, my comb, my edge brush, my wig brush. <laughs> My face wash, serum, toner, and moisturizer. I like a little sleepover thing. I just came to Sweat House. I haven't been here in a few months, and I just felt like I just really needed to come to the sauna and sweat, okay? So, yeah, I'm here. This is my first time actually in the double suite, so I kind of wanted to show you guys what it was giving because. I don't think I'm gonna go back to a single suite ever because I like the space. Okay? This is the shower. It's huge. And then this is the actual sauna room. So it, it, it's enough to fit two people comfortably. And then they have the cooling rags, towel, and they also have like face wash for you, shampoo, conditioner, body wash for both. Two people can take a shower at once. Look. And they also even have like lotion and like spray deodorant and stuff for both men and women. So yeah, and you get an entire hour. Typically I don't sit in the sauna straight for an hour, obviously. And, and the hour includes your time to shower and stuff like that. So um, I typically do maybe like 15 minutes in, two, three minutes out, go back in 15 minutes two, three minutes out, I go in and out of the sauna. Cause your girl I'm not trying to pass. Somebody get me. Somebody tell me the answers. Me and you isn't the answer. Me and you isn't the answer. Maybe I'm telling myself that There ain't nothing that'll change that What good would it be If I knew how you felt about me? It could've been right, but I was wrong Only think about you and you alone Part of me that cared is just gone And I know that I can't get caught up That was great, but this time I sat in there the entire time. I don't know if you can tell, but your girl got a really good sweat in, okay? I like to go in there naked, okay? I just like to be free. I lay on a towel. I get the other towel that I'm using to dry off with after I get out of the shower to put underneath my neck, and I just be laying there. After I do my stretch, after I do like a little teeny bit of yoga, um, I literally just lay there for the entire time, and I feel so good. So I literally have less than 10 minutes left, so I got out just, in, just to give myself enough time for me to shower and stuff, but yeah, your girl felt good. I'm just hoping that my wig is still good. Even though I'm gonna fix it, I just hope that it's still intact because I ain't bring no dryer at all. Look, I'm here, over here trying to preach. I need to practice what I preach, i.e. at least going weekly. Like twice a week would be great, but at least once a week. Make this like a Sunday care routine for me, that'd be great because it's just so relaxing. Yeah, y'all saw that? That was sweat. That's a lot of sweat. You can't even see. I don't wanna show y'all my body. But your girl is like dripping right now. But oh, they give you two cooling rags. I needed to use it because I literally just sat in the sun the entire time. But they give you two cooling rags, or you can get two cooling rags. So they come in like citrus, lavender, something else, and mint. This mint one is new. Oh my god, it smells so good. And then this one is lavender. I pick lavender and mint. Oh, I need two together. Feels so good. Let me hurry and get a shower because I only really got five minutes left. I'm just trying to cool my body down with these bags. Oh, it's so good. One should be for your face and one should be for your body, but I 
Okay, first and foremost, please don't mind my lashes right now. When I got out of the shower, I just started pulling on them. Look, they've been on for a week and a half now. So it's definitely time for me to redo them. By the way, I saw somebody's comment underneath one of my lash videos. And they were like, I thought that this was going to be a how-to video with the rolling of the eyeballs. Okay, I got you. I heard you loud and clear. So today I'm going to be doing my lashes, okay? <laughs> I'm going to be doing my lashes and I'm going to record a dedicated how-to step-by-step video for y'all and I'll post it by the end of the week. Okay? I heard you loud and clear, Miss Attitude. Okay, back to the video. And I showered again because I was out of a very long time. I ended up going to Zara, as y'all already know. I was at Zara and Lix. And I came across this really cute set. And, but the set came with a pair of pants, right? And two tops. Like, you could choose between two tops. And I really liked one of the tops. Like, it was giving real sexy. I was like, oh, yeah, I'm going to look real sexy in this. But the pants were a little big. So I'm like... Damn, I really like this outfit though. You know when you really like something, you just you just want to buy it anyways, even if it's too small or too big. If it's too small, you can be like, I'm gonna lose weight to get into it. If it's too big, you can be like, okay, I'll just get the tailored. So the pants was a size six. I'm like, damn. So I ended up going with the other top because the other top, I was able to kind of finesse that big old gap in the back by covering it with the top on the pants. If that makes sense. So I was like, you know what? Forget it. I'm just get this one. Even though the top is still cute, but I was like, let me just get this one. Go to the register. I asked the girl at the register. Mind you, I had to stay in a long line because our line is long. So I get to the register and I was like, could you do you mind? Could you like please check and see if you got this in a size four? So she had went to go check. She was gone for a little bit. So I feel like people behind me was kind of like mad. Like, girl, you don't see this long ass line? You gonna ask this girl to? Anyways, that was a good yes. I am. So she came back maybe like five, six minutes later, and she was like, um, we don't have it in the size, in the size that you're looking for, but Cumberland does, which is another mall. And I was like, Cumberland does? I didn't know if I felt like going all the way over there. And I had, or while she was gone, I had went online to see if I could just order offline, but it was out of stock online. I'm like, get the fuck up here. So when she told me that, I was like, mm, I don't know about that. I'm gonna just get them. So I ended up getting the pants in the size six and the top that I got. But when I got in the Uber, I was like, no, I'm gonna go get those pants. So I had changed my destination from home to go all the way to Cumberland to find those pants. I get to Cumberland, I asked like one of the associates and they found the pants in a size four for me. I was like, yeah. <laughs> I should have gotten the other top, but I still stuck with the top that I got because something told me like, just stick with the top. But I don't know, I gotta try this outfit on now that I'm at home to see if I wanted to stick with this top or not. But anyway, so I get to Cumberland. Why Cumberland line? I'm thinking Linux line is long. Cumberland line, it got three parts of their Zara. Their line is wrapped around one entire section and the half of the other. So two departments is lined, is lined up to get in line to check out. So I'm like, damn. So I literally stood in line for an hour and about an hour and 20 minutes just to swap out sizes of those pants. 
So yeah, this picture, uh, this outfit, when I take a picture in this outfit, it better slay because the girl went through hell and back to get the size pants that she wanted, okay? I don't even know if they fit the way they need to fit. I just, I just, I don't know. But yeah, this is the outfit. It's so cute. When y'all see me post this picture on Instagram, I'm gonna need y'all to stick, like, like the picture. Even if you don't like the picture, just like the damn picture because your girl went through hell and back. Your Kendra went through hell and back. But it's look, okay? But yeah, these are the pants. I was like, these are so cute. These are the pants, they're straight legged at the bottom. Hmm, I thought these are cute. I'm gonna look so cute in this. And then this is the top. So it's a hot top. Got a little zip in the back. I think this is gonna be so cute. I'm like low key contemplating. I'm gonna try this outfit on real quick. But I'm low key contemplating whether or not I should get the other top or not. I don't know. But um, yeah, I just gotta think of like what shoe and what bag and how I want my hair. I really wanna go get the other top. I might do that. I don't know. And I got this cute little sweater. Hopefully, y'all can see the vision. But I got this really cute sweater with the pearls dangling. I think that this is so cute because I have like a pearl bag that I've never worn and I had it for a very long time um, that I could wear with this. That I think that'd be really cute. Maybe with some denim. You know what I'm saying? Some really cute shoes, you know. So yeah, that's all I got from um, Zara. And why that stuff came up to like $160? This is why I don't like shopping because you know what I could have did? With $160? Now I get it. Now I get it. But um, yeah, um, <laughs> there's gonna have to be a part three to this vlog because I'm tired and we still have to, we still got a lot of stuff that we need to do that, that we said we was gonna do um, that I'm just not gonna do right now. So yeah. If you ended up liking this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. If you're not already subscribed and you made it all the way to the end, what y'all waiting for? Go ahead and hit that subscribe button and hit that bell notification button too so that way you don't miss out on part three. And if you didn't see part one, go ahead, watch part one. I'm gonna leave it. I'm gonna, actually, I'm gonna leave my self-love journey playlist um, listed at the end on the end screen of this video. You probably see it right now because this is like the end of the video. You probably see it like right here somewhere. But yeah, that about it. I hope y'all enjoy. Look, your girl been busting her a-hole, okay? Yeah, buddy. All right, I'm out. I'm out. <laughs>